I hope you can hear me. I'll put the microphone closer. Right, so as you can see, I've shipped in Donut Trump. Um, I'm just going to um, do my Twitch thing. <laughs> um, just turn the sound down. Right. Okay. Just in case anyone says anything, then I can see it. So, here we go. I'm going to, uh, I'll keep it, everything very contained and very kind of graphic-y. So, just creating a circle. Oh, then on the wrong level. And then I'll select transform selection and just do this. <laughs> Make a smaller selection. Crop it. Oh no. Deselect that. And then I'll get the marquee tool. Let's take that away. And then start sort of modelling his hair. Calls. Let's see. Where's, where's my my reference? Yeah. So he's sort of um, he's got a preceding hairline, hasn't he? Sort of comes down his head. So this is going to be a sort of greeny colour. But again, I think I'm going to keep it all fairly controlled. Um, right, let's go in a bit closer. Oops. And I use uh, these two presets, which I got from, I can't remember. Oh, sorry, mate. I'll come back to you and um, add on it 20, it's slightly thinner. I'll do that on another leveling in a second, so. I'll give you nice uh, thin and thicks. And if I don't like it, I'll just come back with the eraser, eraser, and uh, rub it out. And I've got it on another level, so I can move it about as well if I want to. Here we go. Let's just move that along a bit. Use the navigator tool to do that. Oh my I hope you like it. I think it's quite a funny little joke. Um, I think what will make it funny is that um, it is fairly innocent and nothing like Donald Trump <laughs> I've had enough of him already I mean this is exhausting and I'm just wondering because I think he's the oldest US president ever for a first term certainly the fattest for about a hundred years but they say that it ages you <laughs> You look how um, Clinton aged through the eight years and uh, Obama. You think, oh God, this guy's going to be like, uh, I don't know, you know that what happens in Brazil, if you've ever seen it, this woman keeps having these facelifts until she turns into a pile of bones. You know, I can imagine Trump just being this sack of flesh and sinew that they just pour out <laughs> from a presidential sack. So, yeah. But, you know, I have a feeling that he doesn't let um, world issues really trouble him. <laughs> he's, um, he's not really in this reality. He's in his own little world where um, 24 is, you know, his source material. Don't know if they even make that anymore. Do they still make 24? Yeah, so, anyway. But, you know, I've never met him, so he could be really nice, I suppose. 
I get the impression he isn't. I think what you see is what you get, unfortunately. Um, this really um, bemused that why people voted for him. He just looks like um, like an emperor. You know these fat, greasy emperors that are licking like grease off their fingers because they've just killed a partridge and eaten it. Ugh. Well, there goes the dog. Right. So his hair kind of coiffures round. Again, I want to keep it fairly sedate. I don't want to go too mad with that. I think you should have e uh, ears. Maybe the ears will have sprinkles as well. So it's all got to be fairly subdued, I think. I don't usually do subdued. My work's pretty frenetic, but um, yeah. Right. Okay. I'm looking on my channel. It's not saying I'm on there, which is a bit weird. Go back. Just uh, stick tunes. Just wanted to see if. Ah, um, oh, right. Okay. It started again. Right. Sorry about that. Okay. So yeah, that looks quite nice. Quite happy with that. So, cause it's oh, uh, does he need ears? Hmm. See that one? What have I done there? Yeah, they're sort of, they're not straight, are they? <laughs> uh, I'm not sure he does, you know. I reckon. Let's bring up the... Uh, the guide. Oh, wow. That is so strange. Oh, I know why. That looks so weird. No, look. The ears are um, wonky. I don't think he needs ears. So yeah, I mean they're pretty, but I think what they need to be is they need to be dead on uh, symmetrical actually. So I will remove that one and just bring this one down. I'm using a Wacom tablet. There we go, Wacom tablet. A bit old fashioned, I think. I think I'm gonna to have to get one of these screens and work on that. But the thing I like about the Wacom tablet is your pen doesn't get in the way. You look directly at the image. Someone will sort of say, it's bullshit. And, um, oh, well, that's why I work. <laughs> but, um, pardon me, sorry, I've just eaten an apple. Oh dear. Um, so I'm going to do these wickle, wickle hands. Wickle, wickle hands. I don't know. Should it be, should they be like little stalks? Like that. Is that funnier? I want the hands to be almost like paws. Uh, let me see, does that look good? It does really, doesn't it? Kind of looks flappy and pathetic. Yeah. Go with your gut. Try not to miss a trick because you've only got one chance, really. I know you can overthink things. 
but it's good to just pause and think, well, hang on a minute, is there a better idea? Because you can get yourself trapped by falling in love with a, an idea and you become hostage to it. So you've got to go, right, hang on a minute, is there a funnier idea after that one? You know, is this the best option? I think a lot of writers sort of fall in love with ideas. They forget about the story. And then, you know, they kind of write around ideas and uh, they don't actually, doesn't actually make sense. I'm just tidying that up a little bit. Just making nice thick thins. So where it comes into the fingers, it's, it gets thinner. As a sort of uh, cartoon logic to it, and that that's a bit untidy, just there, a bit inelegant. So I've just snipped that off. Yeah, then that becomes a bit fat. Hang on a second. Now, I mean, I could have done this in. Um, in Illustrator. And Illustrator is alright, but I just find it a bit too claustrophobic. I do like the, and I know this is supposed to be <laughs> kind of tight, but also you lose a bit of flair as well. Uh, does it need to be the same thickness as the outside bit let's see i'm not sure it does i think it's quite nice that it is a bit flimsier than the main body you know like flailing little arms um, let me see yeah i think that because they are weedy and pathetic so i think that kind of works let me just Keep that line consistent. And it just comes into there like so. I'll just nip this line back a bit as well. Like that. Yeah, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to cheat. I'm going to cheat. And flip it. I've done a copy of it, but I think it's nice it, that it's, it is symmetrical. I'm just going to flatten those two bad boys and then make it part of the body like that. Right, so. For the eyes, I'm going to do sort of 1930s Betty Boo, Betty Boop, Betty Boo, Betty Boop, I think it's Betty Boop, Boop Boop Betty Boop, Betty Boop, and uh, a nice sort of blue, mm, maybe nice and blue, yeah, select, do 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 do, sort of bigger, top and then I'm going to flip that round on oh, my wife's home. <laughs> I think she'll be right. She might say hello. Ignore her. <laughs> Don't look at her. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So they're all, you know, really tight. And this, this is very similar to uh, the 1930s. Da, 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 da. And I think they were using plates and things <laughs> to, to draw. Because I don't think many people did animation in those days. You had some really good ones and then some really bad ones. So uh, they had to have um, styles and things that everyone could do. So you 
pretty much animating to your worst animator. So they were using coins and things. So that's why it's, if you look at their um, animation, the character design, Betty Boo is all, is all circles me. Um, but it sort of developed a, a style that, you know, we do today. See a lot of the uh, sort of really cute artwork. And it is basically um, the 1930s style, just sort of uh, brought up to, you know, 21st century. Um, so yeah, uh, but I think the nose, I think the nose I can, I mean I've done it like a dew drop, I don't know whether, maybe I could sort of crabby eyes it. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, Oh, Charlie, do you want to get down? Sorry, I've got to let the dog down. Go and get down, my darling. Go on, don't you get? Go on. difficult to actually look at my own stuff. It keeps playing bloody adverts and then it doesn't do... Oh, I don't know. Anyway. Okay. So, yeah. I'm sure you're seeing what I'm doing. At least I'm just on mine. She's very understanding. Uh, yeah. I think there needs to be a certain crabby element to it. Sort of uh, crusty. Yeah, crush. Really crushed. Um, I think we can say that he's probably the crustiest president for a while. Um, let me know who you nominate to be crustier. Uh, Lyndon Johnson, he was pretty, pretty crusty, I'd say. I uh, don't know too many presidents, but he seemed quite crusty. Um, from what I gather, but uh, you know, if you're American and you know better, let me know who's crustier than Trump, and um, I bow to your knowledge. Uh, okay, right, that's it. Uh, just do his, his, his little mouth. Hey, <laughs> oh, he's got a lovely little mouth. Um, yep. Oh, it's it. Sorry. Oh. Sometimes just do it quick. what's going on in my head <laughs> you see um, I think the left side of your brain no no the right side of your brain controls the left side but it's non-verbal so uh, and I think that's the artistic bit so that's the noises it makes that's why a lot of um, artists are left-handed. There's a higher proportion of artists and um, um, architects that are left-handed. So I think, actually, me being right-handed makes it harder to be an artist. I'd say. Oh but I think I tend to do uh, funnier things 
um, drawing uh, than actually thinking about it. So when I sit down and start drawing, things just happen. And people ask me, where does that come from? I, I think it's the left side of the brain, the non-verbal side. Like speaking to the dead. Oh, there we go. Hang on a second. Tiny little feet. <laughs> just find it difficult to believe that he's president but there you go you know oh yeah that looks quite nice <laughs> and I think I'll repeat that yes um thinking about um, Rick and Morty actually a lot of the characters in that are very reminiscent of Betty Boo uh, who's the guy who gets shot oh my god I can't remember his name Mr Poopy Pants <laughs> oh man that is just so funny uh, yeah should he be running mm. yeah why not Let's do that. He's running. Yeah, but if you look at his design, the big eyes, and you know, I mean, that is just ripped off from um, the 1930s animation, that era. And they know they're doing that. Uh, no, they're, they're brilliant. If, uh, if if you want to if you want to give me a job, I'd love to work on it, but uh, I don't think they will. Somehow, I think they're doing all right job without me. Shame. Right, so um, for eyeballs, big ones, big like you know. And a double one like that. A reflection, that is. Bing. Oh, hang on. Let's do that. And then repeat. Oh. That's just super, super sickeningly cute. Uh, and just trim that off. Bing. Uh, as you can see, that's on the layer below. Shall I do eyebrows? I think he probably does need eyebrows. So, and I'll do do that again. Um, what I'll do is another layer, and then, oh, I tell you what, I'll I'll do an arc like this. Hang on a second. There goes a dog. Uh, that's my Twitter feed, and I think that's my Instagram as well. Uh, so yeah, if you want to follow me on Instagram, oh, pardon me, Twitter, and I think um, YouTube. YouTube's losing out big time to this stuff, isn't it? They've really got to get their finger out. They're going to turn into a MySpace, I think, if they're not careful. And I don't think uh, YouTube makes any money. I don't think they've made any money yet. That's what Comic Girl 19 was telling me anyway. On the bus. When she was eating chips. Chips in England are french fries. Um, and uh, we call your chips crisps. Okay. So when you come to England, ask for chips, you'll get a bag of potatoes. Are cut up okay so just just bear that in mind when you come to England or Britain right yeah because I, I went to Romania and they, they they call crisps chips 
So that was that confused the hell out of me. But then I think they kind of learn their English from American, uh, you know, films and things. They love, um, uh, oh God, what are they called? Transformers. So they, places like Romania are responsible for Ma Michael Bay making more Transformers. So, you know, that's, that, yeah, now I agree with Brexit. Okay, um, so uh, I'm going to colour this lovely, lovely um, human being up. <laughs> This guy should run for president. He did. Right. Okay. So let's get a nice donutty colour. I think that's a nice donutty colour. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe slightly orangey or. This isn't. Maybe I'm not streaming. Well, I'm annoyed if I'm not. Come on, you. No one's viewing it anyway. <laughs> well, I'm new to this. Leave me alone. Uh, and then it's going to play another advert. Very annoying. <laughs> right, okay. Anyway, I'll put this on Facebook. They'll love it. Facebook has come on in leaps and bounds. I uh, was at a conference a couple of years ago and they said that they thought Facebook was going to disappear in 2017. Well, it hasn't. And actually Twitter is the one that's um, suffering at the moment, isn't it? Right, so... <sighs> let's give him some lovely, lovely little red cheeks. Um, oh yeah, oh man, that's good. <laughs> and then, and then, uh, let's do this, which is This could take some time. <laughs> Bear with me. Do yellow. Oh, there goes a dog again. I think that's enough yellow. What do you reckon? And a red. No skill involved whatsoever. You get blue sprinkles. I'm going to put this on a t shirt, by the way. Um, I'm opening a little t shirt shop. I'll let you know what it is, uh, where it is soon. It's going to be in the next couple of weeks. I think it's going to be called Busby Tees. Busby Tees. So check it out. I've got a business partner. Uh, maybe green? Do you have green? Hello. Yeah. You have green, don't you? some horizontals there. Yeah. Um, fairly happy with that I think. Alright. I think let's just hang on a sec. 
sec. Uh, okay, yeah. Maybe a shadow. Maybe a shadow. Let's see. Inverse that. Stick a little shadow on there. Oh yeah, that's quite nice. And a little sort of crusty shadow on his nose. Same again, pull for ball. And then maybe a little shadow on that lovely luxurious hair. Yeah, I don't know. I can't see my own feed. So I'm terribly sorry if I can't um, talk to you. Come on. Oh! I can see myself. Finally. Thank you very much. Right, okay. God, it took long enough. Might be doing something wrong. Anyway, yep -a -doo -a -doo. there we go. Oh, itchy nose. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, so I don't know. Yeah, I, mm, you see, my lettering is shocking. Shocking lettering. Uh, shall I do some lettering? Uh, what I'll do. Is hang on, write it go oh, nut Trump. Oh, I quite like that lettering. <laughs> That's lucky. Uh, it's a bit close. It's just, um, oops, that one. That's maybe a hundred and five, hundred and six. Yeah. Okay. I'll smooth. And let's have a look at making it slightly curved. I think arch it, but that way. Donut Trump. Lovely. Uh, let's just right. Okay, I'm gonna layer, layer style. Put a stroke around it, and the colour will be a sort of darker version of that, or maybe that actually. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. Hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. Uh, this is highlight. Oh, yeah. Just um, highlight this. And maybe do the colour. So it echoes it. That makes sense to me. Uh, Donut Trump. Donut Trump. Hang on a sec. Hang on a second. What about? Let's move this all over here. Yeah, that might look very nice. Hang on a second. It's called Sort It Out. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh no, right. Then if I. Hang on a second. Oh, what am I doing? Sorry about that. That's it. Then inverse. And then. Donut 
Donut Trump. Is that working? <laughs> I don't know. G looks a bit rubbish. Hang on. Uh, oh dear. Pardon me. Terribly sorry. Um, I'm just sticking a few bits myself. Beep doop 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 Donut Trump and then a pink boop -doop 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 -doop. Oh yeah. Yum 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 yum. Kinda of works. Donut Trump. And then at the bottom in kind of childish writing, which I can do. Believe me, uh, just do <laughs> tongue comes out. <laughs> Come on, you can hurt, you can write. Weave. Looks wrong for some reason. With sprinkles. Yeah. With sprinkles. There goes a dog again. <laughs> So you have seen a t-shirt design being born. We've been good. Uh, yeah, so er, you, er, er, er. Yeah, uh, I like that. I like it. Yeah. Uh, wonder whether there should be uh, mm. am I gonna do this yeah oh I tell you what yeah I know what I'll do I'll do a yes 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 I do and then there uh, and I think this some can move in a little bit this one can move in a little bit actually uh, yep Donald Trump do not trump with sprinkles I'm happy with that. <coughs> yeah. Yes. No. Tell you what. What he needs is blue eyes. So. Leave it with me. Oh yeah, perfect, perfect. Right, chaps. Oh, 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 oh. One more thing, actually. Here, I think he should have a shiny bit of, you know, shine. Basically, a bit of whiteness. Bing. Oh. Yes. Okay. Well, that's it. I'm done. Um, yeah, 
that's it. Okay, chaps. Well, thanks for watching. Um, spread the word if you like. I don't know. Um, nice to see you. And um, I'll do more of these if you want. So follow me uh, I'm on Twitter and stuff. I'm on Facebook. Bill Greenhead. That's it. You know, Facebook. And um, that's it. I'm going. Yeah, I'll need to sit down. Nine o'clock here, almost. So uh, I need to see my wife. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.